What's up everyone, Game Master 468 here, bringing you the next part of my Fairly Odd Parents freaking little walk through as I move the camera up and down very awkwardly. It's really, really odd. But anyways, here with me again is my friend Toontown Professor. Um, and hopefully he'll have more stuff to say this time around. Here for a third time. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Okay, don't fall asleep, Timmy, because we're going to do the level Mini Timmy. Maybe I should have a bath. It's been three weeks. What? Hey, Your last bath was three me? weeks? Shut it, shrimp! It's my job to persecute you, and I'll... Ah! There's a spider in the bath! Ew. And I guess you're scared of spiders, right? I suppose you like spiders. I guess you yucky things stick together. Don't worry, I'll rescue the spider and pop it out the window. He'll come back. This bath is so filthy, it attracts evil. I can't even look at it without getting sick. It so needs cleaning. I wish there was some way you could scrub every little nook and tiny itsy bitsy cranny. Uh -oh. I want spotless. Are you done with that spider yet? Timmy Turner, you creep! Come back here and clean this bath! What has she done to me? Oh no, everyone. Vicky has wished Timmy to be super duper small. That is not good. And now we're in the icky sewer type thingy. Where bad stuff goes. Sewer levels. It doesn't matter what game they're in, sewer levels will always be sewer levels. And sewer levels are annoying. Snap out of it! We may be able to wring enough power from our wands for one little wish! Whoa! Oh, hey, it's that one suit that Timmy had in that one episode. Right, Timmy in a can. Oh, From that one season, on that one TV, on that one day, yeah. on that one month, on that one year. Deadly environment. <laughs> Whoa, this armor's pretty cool. I bet it has all sorts of excellent gadgets and weapons. Well, yes, if you like cleaning, you can attack to, um, clean stuff. Oh, guess. But life saving. Thanks, guys. Well, it's a long way back. We'd better get started. And keep your eyes open for wish stars. We're gonna need them. All right. So new new character control, new controls. Okay. So if you hold down the circle button here, you can use spray stuff to make it set smell like buttercups and rainbows and. Could yeah, you imagine? I'm glad we need to jump across these thingies so we can get out of here. Whoa, that was close. Could you imagine in a fight where um, you could choose your weapon and then you say, I want a weapon that can make everything be like rainbows and lollipops? <laughs> That'd be awesome, dude. <laughs> it'd be really awkward, but it'd be awesome. Alright, so here we are. We already got our second wish star. That is really awesome. Alright, so we need to explore this cheese type thingy. We're going to find more wish stars. Ah, bad camera angle. Okay. Okay. That's, that would be something to brag about. My weapon of death is rainbows. <laughs> uh, weapon of death. The power of rainbows. Fear it. I just feared the power of itchy gooey stuff. All right. Yeah. Ew. What are those piles made from, and do we have to step on them? They're made of grime, and yes, we will be leaping across them. I wonder what grime is. Grape and lime, maybe? No, I'm pretty sure grime isn't grape and lime, Cosmo. That that'd be a really bad combination. All right, we're just making our way through here, hoping I'm not missing any wish stars. Because I haven't played this level in a while, so hopefully I know what I'm doing. Um, as for exploring this cheese type thing, is there anything to talk about? As for the third time that you've asked if there's anything to talk about, still there's really nothing to talk about except. Well, that's for... fantastic. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 like the the best that's thing the ever. Best thing ever, yeah. Ooh, bouncy thingy. If we find a wish star- no, it's just a Crimson Gen card. Boo. 
That stinks. Huh. Okay, I guess there's nothing here. We'll just keep going, guys. Yeah. Ah, ah, okay, we do need to come up here so we can get the squish star. Alright. Eh. Don't get it. What gives away? I don't know, but. Eh, eh. Ah, okay, don't step on that green stuff or you're gonna slip and slide around. It's fun if you're in, like, that slip and slide pool toy type thingy. Not so much fun when you're, like, 50 feet from your desk. <laughs> so, uh. Okay, I guess it's up to me to think of something to talk about. Um, because it's, it's it's pretty straightforward level. Now you really just have to like, just follow the set path, you know, and catch stars along the way. This this bridge isn't safe. It's all slippery and wobbly. Take your time, sweetie. All right, and watch out for this purpley stuff because it slows you down. And let's see, um, how about that Sly 4 game? That looks like it's gonna be awesome. Thieves in time. Yeah, thieves in time. I'm probably not gonna get that. As much as I want to, I probably, well, like, even if I want to, I probably won't be able to. Why not? And this well, stuff launches you up in the air, by the way. Okay. I don't know. Um, is it a... Is there like a specific copy for it that'll be for like just the P like for the PS3 too, or just the PS2 and some other consoles? It's not coming out for the PS2 at all. It's just the PS3. Yep, people have forgotten about the PlayStation 2. Well, that's kind of what happens with all with all old consoles. You know, it's all about the new consoles, and it's like, okay, no one cares about these old consoles anymore. We're just gonna focus on the new consoles. That's, that's what I never stupid. That's what I never understood, because if you look at facts, I kind I know that this kind of sounds stupid, but I always thought that the PlayStation 2 was always better than the PlayStation 3. And I know that sounds kind of stupid, but I'm just going to point that out. I think people, um, they, well, I'm sure a lot of people do think PS2 is better than PS3, but those who think that the PS3 is better than PS2 is probably just because, oh, we love the graphics. That's what it's all about. You know? I just want to point this out, even though it's kind of stupid because I'm stereotyping a group of people, but uh, I just want to say anyone who only cares about graphics in a game, is an that's, that's <laughs> kind of really stupid. Um, but hey, we, get, we have five stars, we're going to make our wish, I've been running around doing nothing for quite a while because I want to get through this conversation, we'll continue it in a bit. But well, let's go through this cutscene because that's what this game's all about. Cutscenes. That game <laughs> is full of cutscenes. Yep. I love this part. Wish time. Yeah, wish time's well, awesome. We have to cross Chasm's bridge by. Uh, uh, let's just call those ropes, shall we? What's it gonna be? Nah, I think they're like really multiple celery sticks. I guess I want to walk ropes like that Crimson Chin though and Doctor Plummet. Which one's Doctor Plummet? Was he one of the Brotherhood of Ineffectual Evil? Let's just use our imaginations. Uh, guys, this isn't quite what I had in mind. Well, it's the best we can do. You'll be able to walk across automatically. You just have to worry about which direction you're walking in. How cool is that? I know you guys try. I guess I should just say thanks, but I won't. Ugh, Jimmy's so rude. All right, so we have like a new- You just said Jimmy. Oh, Jimmy? I meant Timmy. You're not Jimmy. <laughs> You don't have a big head. Your head's normal, okay? It's your teeth, that's huge. Anyway, so we can knock on ropes now. It's really just the basic thing where when you're balancing on ropes, push left and right on the left analog stick to balance yourself. Basic you type know, thing. It's been done several times in many video games. You know what I never understood? What? Well, this is kind of off topic, but uh, on topic in the same way. But why does Vicky even hate them? Was she just, like, naturally evil? Or, like, what did they do to get Vicky to hate them? I don't know. That'd be a great episode, like, to tell her backstory. That'd be really awesome. Do they still even make episodes of Very Odd Parents anymore? Or is it, like, Yeah, rare? they do. I've actually seen a new episode of it yesterday, actually. There was a new episode? <laughs> yeah. It, it was probably just... It, it probably wasn't a premiere episode, but it was just, like, a new episode I haven't seen. Um, it was newer, for sure, definitely. Right, let's go after the star. 
And then, uh, what were we talking? Oh, yeah, people who think that games are PlayStation about graphics. consoles. <laughs> consoles and graphics. Yeah. Uh, uh, oh, I got it. I, I can't. That, that's actually funny that we mentioned the graphics and stuff. Because I actually was listening to Sly Cooper music on the internet. Because I was getting, like, you know, was getting ready for the Sly 4 game and all that stuff. Getting prepared. And I was reading the comments. And I saw this guy who literally said, and I quote, Oh, this game stinks. Games are all about the graphics and blood and gore. Take that in for a moment. I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> He's probably gonna rage. <laughs> Alrighty. Um... So yeah, we're just balancing on these, not really exciting. Alright, I've gotten over it. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, to that guy. Um, unfortunately, there are a lot of words I want to say here, but I can't. <laughs> because this is a family friendly video. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, you can. That's you can like gotta be the stupidest thing I've ever seen. I know people think that games are all about the graphics sometimes, but for him to say that it's all about blood and gore, that's new to me. Like seriously, that's gotta be the well, stupidest thing I've ever heard. There are three possibilities. Either one, he's one of those people who just plays Call of Duty 24/7. B, he spends his whole life on the Xbox. Or three, he's all about guns. That is actually funny you mentioned Call of Duty, because that's another comment you left. Oh, this game stinks, because it's not Call of Duty. LOL. I'll be right back. No. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so once we complete that challenge, platforms appear and we can go back. If you miss, like, stars and stuff like that. Really handy. But we're going to save our game here. And it's been 12 minutes. I think that's a... Well... Mm, since it's a level that doesn't have a boss, I guess we can go for like a little bit longer. No wait, this, this level does have a boss, actually. It does have a boss. Okay, so we're gonna end it off here. In the next video, we're gonna continue our way through the sewer and hopefully get to the top. And yeah, and then we'll continue our little rant about guys who think that it's all about graphics. And hopefully I'll still be here. Yeah. Well, you, you, you will be, because I'm going to be recording it again now. Um, so yeah, oh, see you oh. then, everyone.